Well, there we are back at um, where I seem to be spending a lot of time at the moment, uh, fleet services. Uh, the reason we're here is because, to, because today uh, we're traveling to Thorpe Park for um, what's this, like take two of Annabelle's birthday week. And I do mean week, she's just like her mother. Apparently um, a birthday isn't enough anymore. You've got to have activities all through the week. So um, we did bowling and a meal out a uh, day before yesterday. Uh, that was with one set of grandparents. Today is her main birthday present. She wanted to go to a theme park, so we're off to Thorpe Park. Uh, we're going to stay overnight at a hotel nearby uh, and then have a second day there tomorrow. So I'm um, spoilt little girl. But um, this morning uh, we've travelled from home to Fleet. It's uh, 60 miles door to door. Now, uh, just a reminder, 24 kilowatt hour leaf. Um, I've had it for two, nearly two and a half years, 30,000 miles. It was fully loaded this morning with the four of us and suitcase in the boot. Uh, we got about four miles up the road, realized we'd forgotten some tickets, had to turn around and go back. So uh, I've put about eight miles on, so about 68 miles to get here. Uh, and I've got about, I think it was about 18% left. So uh, 68 miles, uh, it was 18%, about 18 miles. Do you know what? If I could do 78 miles on a charge, I'm over the moon, and that's motorway speeds. I've been traveling anything between 60 and 70 miles an hour, depending where I was on the motorway, simply because I knew I was gonna be a bit tight getting here. But um, I thought I was gonna be a lot tighter than that. So I, I know that I can comfortably do 60 miles on a motorway in this car, but actually I can do cl closer to 80. And I've always said, you know, if I'm driving carefully, I can do 80 miles in this car. So actually, you know, we're heading back towards 100 miles again, which um, which surprised me. I obviously haven't been driving as economically as I um, could do recently. <laughs> Well, that worked out really well. We've arrived. I uh, had to do uh, well, a charge to 90% at Fleet. That should be enough to get me here to Thorpe Park, to the hotel tonight, back to Thorpe Park, and back to the charger tomorrow at Fleet. But that said, I've arrived here at Thorpe Park and they've got um, seven kilowatt, I think they're seven kilowatt post chargers. So I managed to get plugged in there. So, uh, so far, so good. That was very fast. No, I told you it looked faster than it actually is. Mummy, look, you're going away! You're going away! You alright? Yeah! <laughs> Which bit did you like best? When we, um, when we got in to the top and you can see the trap, and then when all of a sudden, so we like the big drop down and all of a sudden you just went down. And the track disappeared and it yeah. looked like we were all going to die. <laughs> well there we go, today's worked out really really well. Um, We've had lots of fun, we're all worn out, we've had a good meal, uh, we're all feeling pretty good. So um, we're gonna get the kids sorted and get them into bed. Uh, as far as charging and getting here today, we've had no issues whatsoever. Uh, fleet was great, there was charging at Thorpe Park, there's charging here at the hotel if I need it. But to be honest, I've got more than enough to get back to Thorpe Park and back to Fleet tomorrow, so um, there's no issues whatsoever. It doesn't even factor into any worry or concern for this trip at all. So uh, even with that small leaf of mine, uh, we're gonna be absolutely fine. But for now, uh, I'm gonna get back to the room. We've got a few drinks, get the kids to bed, and uh, we'll do it all again tomorrow. <laughs> Aren't we having fun? <laughs> Mummy's gonna get a wet bottom! She's not! Yeah. Oh my god! I'm scared to fall off the. Oh. 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 Oh.
Um, nearly the end of two absolutely brilliant days but um, we've got about 80 miles to drive home and I thought at some point we've got to stop so we'd stop sooner rather than later and I know at Fleet if you come into the town there's a free charger so um, we've pulled in but there's two cars waiting ahead of us so rather than waiting around we've grabbed a takeout and I think we'll probably make Roundhams and um, get a top-up charge there before we head home so um, it's not all plain sailing but uh, not too bad at the end of the day what is a shame is um, this is a free charger, one of the few rapids around, but, uh, uh, and an e-golf, don't see many of those. What's an e-golf? That's an e-golf, Thomas. Before he parked his car, I did manage to have a chat with the um, guy that owns that e-golf. He, um, he said he doesn't have any home charging, so he charges purely out and about, and he gets about 120 miles, regardless of kind of what driving he does. Um, he's very, very pleased with it. It's the first generation one. Uh, he said he's obviously he's waiting for the second one to come out, but um, yeah, another happy EV driver. Well, we've had to stop at Winchester. That's nearly a disaster. Um, Schoolboy error on my point. Uh, I always try and avoid uh, head. Excuse me. I always try and avoid stopping at the last point, uh, kind of point of no return, um, which is what I was going to do at Roundham's on the M27. Uh, thankfully, I checked my app on the way and found that um, it was out of order. So. Uh, we managed to stop at Winchester, we're getting a quick charge. Uh, it's about 40 miles home and um, we're all plugged in and no issues at all. We're nearly done now and I guess that kind of shows the good and the bad of the charging infrastructure here in this country. Um, we had no issues going up, we've charged everywhere we wanted to, we've plugged in all day at um, Thorpe Park both days. Uh, we had a, a guard from the police, which was very nice. Um, but they looked after our car. But. Um, Coming home, uh, it's just been a little bit awkward, just finding the right charges at the right places where we wanted to stop. And I guess that's where it becomes a little bit of a pain when if, well, perhaps you're not of a mind to uh, change your plans or stop where you hadn't planned. Um, it just becomes a little bit awkward then. Uh, I'm used to it now and, um, you know, you kind of good use of the apps and uh, knowing the infrastructure a little bit better obviously helps and that comes with time. But um, you know, we're fine now, we're nearly 80% and that's what I love, once you get in it fires up through the charge, it takes no time at all um, and uh, by the time Sarah gets back we're going to be 80% and I can zip on home, no issues now, uh, apart from I see there's a bit of traffic which might be a pain, but anyway, uh, we'll be on our way shortly and um, I think subject to anything happening between now and home, um, I might as well end the vlog here. Uh, we've had a brilliant couple of days. Annabelle's had a great time for um, number two birthday present of her birthday week. Uh, there's a couple more days to come. But um, yeah, for now, if you've enjoyed uh, the vlog over the last couple of days, remember to like and share. And if you're not doing so already, subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you again soon. Take care.